Alrighty, on this hunt, uh, got a couple of Danish hunters with me. Jens. And Meta. <coughs> we are uh, out looking for a moose to shoot. That bull's awfully nice. He's awfully wide. I think you'd be pretty happy with him if you shot him. I think you should shoot him. I think you should shoot him. Yeah, he's wide, he's nice, he's got good tines. That's the second and third legal bull I've seen in eight days. But it is your decision. I'm, I'm suggesting that it, he is a nice bull. He's just standing up here perfect broadside at 188 yards. So very shootable. decision we made was we are going to pass on him and let's hope we don't regret the decision <laughs> but we'll be trying 150% to find a big one one of the problems when trophy hunting is at some point the hunter has to make a decision to shoot and on the first day this decision is even harder on all trophy hunts, you need to be prepared to go home without taking an animal, and even more so if you pass on a good trophy. You should never pass on an animal that you would be happy taking later on the hunt. Well, the decision is now made for us because they are out of range now. <laughs> so we don't have to think anymore. We don't have to think about it anymore. He'll uh, live to see another day, which is all good. It's actually kind of nice letting a beautiful animal like that go. He'll grow bigger. He'll grow, He'll bigger. grow bigger, absolutely. Yep. Maybe that bull that I let go last year in the hope that it will grow bigger one day. It's just over this next rise. <laughs> Hopefully. I let a couple of nice bulls go over here last year, so we'll see. Real shit. Well, we've uh, carried on around the face from seeing that nice bull that we passed on. We're now looking down the hill into some prime moose country. A couple of cows and a bull down there. Unfortunately, the bull is uh, not as big as the one we passed on. We're just down here. Cow's doing the typical thing. She's in a pond. What do you think? Perfect. Perfect scenery. It's very nice. Very nice. Well, that bull's probably a three, probably possibly a four-year-old bull. 
showing awesome trophy potential. He's got um, a palmated front end, mm -hmm. brow tines. He's got uh, five, maybe six brow tines on each side with nice paddles, just young. Another two or three years, he'll be a giant. We need to find his dad. We're looking for his dad. It's amazing how long they can hold their breath, eh? The hunting is remaining to be very, very difficult because of the uh, incredible stretch of fine weather we're having. And to boot, we have a full moon, which uh, is encouraging the animals to feed at night when it's cooler, which is what they would rather do and um, therefore sleeping during the day in the heat, in the shade, jungled up, making it very difficult for us to find. We have a squirrel over here that's not very happy about me being here. I've disturbed his mushroom dinner. <clears throat> He's uh, taking mushrooms home with him. Okay, it's the uh, fifth morning and we have spotted a really nice bull and we're putting a bit of a run on him at the moment. We're sneaking down. He's down here probably about five, six hundred yards and we're sneaking down to see if we can't get on him. He's a really nice bull. He's got four brow tines on one side so he's definitely legal. He looks pretty wide, got beautiful big tines. So uh, what do you guys think? You're pretty excited? Yeah, I'm excited <laughs> goal for him. I've been making them work a little. I think they're sweating a little bit because it's day five. So we'll see how we go. Come on, let's roll. Okay, we're getting real close. I think he's just up, just up ahead of us here. We're gonna start slowing down and uh, keeping, keeping a real close eye out. You comfortable? Oh, get ready. Beautiful. <laughs> We have ourselves a beautiful bull moose here this morning. What do you think, uh, Jens? He's very, very nice. And that was an exciting hunt. Yes, and this one is double size of the Swedish one I had shot before. And um, it was a very, very exciting hunt. It's very difficult to hunt in this high bush. <laughs> and uh, we had to run through the bush and try to get a shot of him. So we had our exercise this morning. Yes. I can <laughs> say that. <laughs> we were sweating a lot to get this one. But it, yeah. this was a beautiful hunt and a very, very exciting hunt. And that was what we were going to do. So I'm very, very happy about this beautiful moose.